Frederick the Fox. Written by Kim Ansell and illustrations by Lisa Reed. Frederick the Fox was a grumpy old fellow. He disliked his tea and he hated his cello. He looked round his house which was under a tree and wondered, Is this the best my life can be? He packed up his suitcase and said toodaloo to Rabbit next door and to Owl and Mouse too. He hopped on his bike that he once used to ride and decided his first stop would be the seaside. He got to the beach and he laid out his towel, but the sea made him itch and the sun made him scowl. His fur became matted with salt in the sand and then ice cream melted all over his hand. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They kept his house clean and they took in his post and hoped he was having a nice time by the coast. Fox got on his bike, gave the pedals a kick and decided his next stop would be the Arctic. He got to the ice caps and built an igloo, but the cold made his toes sting and nose go... <laughs> Achoo! His paws kept on sinking down into the snow and even the shop was a long way to go. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They baked him a birthday cake on March the 4th and hoped he was having a nice time in the north. Fox got on his bike not long after arriving and decided his next stop would be deep sea diving. He got to the ocean and pulled on his mask but his nose filled with bubbles from sinking too fast. He squeezed in a shipwreck to hide from a shark but felt very scared all alone in the dark. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They cleaned out his shed and put logs in a heap and hoped he was having a nice time way down deep. Fox crawled on his bike just before it got dark and decided his next stop would be at the park. He got to the playground and slid down the slide but forgot to hold on and he fell off the side. He got on the seesaw, the bar hit his chin and riding the roundabout made his head spin. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They cleaned all his windows and polished his things and hoped he was having a nice time on the swings. Fox leapt on his bike with a frown on his face and decided his next stop would be outer space. He got to the stars, took a spin round the moon, but cycling through space took him all afternoon. He kept floating upwards and spinning around and decided his feet were much safer on ground. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They looked at his photo and let out a sigh and hoped he was having a nice time way up high. Fox whizzed on his bike trying hard not to fall and decided his next stop would be at the pool. He got to the pool and he put on his trunks, but thought to himself it was cold for a dunk. The poolside was slippery and water too deep, and the sign said that you should not run, bomb or leap. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They swept up the leaves, made his hedges look cool, and hoped he was having a nice time at the pool. Fox climbed on his bike with the wind in his hair and decided his next stop would be at the fair. He got to the fair with the big helter-skelter, but it started to rain and he had to take shelter. He went on the dodgems, but it was no fun. He found life was lonely when there was just one. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They thought of him often and never forgot. They cut his long grass and placed pots round the sides and hoped he was having a nice time on the rides. Fox jumped on his bike and turned back to his house. He really was missing Owl, Rabbit and Mouse. Frederick the Fox was a happy old fellow. He loved drinking tea and he treasured his cello. He'd tried to find happiness away from his tree but found that his friends were the one special key. Owl, Mouse and Rabbit missed Frederick a lot. They'd thought of him often and never forgot. It turned out that Frederick was sad when alone and Owl, Mouse and Rabbit were glad he was home.